This is uh, part A of the Density Lab for Chemistry 121. Here I have some, I have 12 pennies that were made before uh, 1981. I'm gonna go ahead and put them on the balance here. So, turn that on. See that it shows zeros. Now I'm going to stack my pennies on here. All right. Break down that value. Make sure the reflection's not on there. Okay. Now I'm going to use my 50 milliliter cylinder and add some water to it. Doesn't have to be exactly 30, but some amount that we'll write down precisely. Get rid of a couple of those air bubbles there. Okay. Now we'll need to read that straight on. good. Looks like it's just above that line. So make sure that you read to um, one tenth of the smallest markings from the bottom of the meniscus. All right. Now I'm going to place my 12 pennies in there. There they are. And now we'll read that again. Okay, you can see I'm straight on with the line at 30. I'm gonna bring it down a little since the water level is above that. That should be about it. So go ahead and make your measurement from the bottom of the meniscus. Okay, next up. I'm going to dry these pennies off and remove a couple of them. Oh, there's still a couple in there. All right. Um, maybe I'll do the next. I'll do uh, trial one of the post-1983 pennies in order to give these a second to really dry out. All right. Here are my post and let's see how many we've got here one two three four five there's ten one, two, three, four, five. That looks like 15 pennies. Is that how many we're supposed to use? I think that's reasonable. All right, I'm going to stick these on the balance. Oh, turned off so the balance reads zero currently. And here's our 
there's the mass measurement. Alrighty, I'll add some water. down in front of the camera for our initial measurement. And then I will put the pennies inside there. bit of air. I'm just gonna shake it around, try and get those air bubbles to come up. All right, looks all right. And I'll put a nice solid background back there. Lift the camera up. Well, I don't feel as able to keep it steady for you. Okay, that's in line with the 25. Now I'm in line with the 30. And that's about in line with the meniscus, I think. So we'll read that from the bottom of the meniscus. Notice it's got that dark line on there. It's reflecting the black desk. Okay, so there's uh, trial one for pre and post pennies. Maybe I'll do the second trial in another video.